Hey everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Drag Nights. And tonight we have Pheromone from All Stars 2 and Season 9 of RuPaul's Drag Race. So we just got home and we got ready for bed, but while I'm doing that, here it is. Speaking of All-Stars, all the way for RuPaul's Drag Race All-Stars season. <laughs> Bitch, I hope she don't fall. I hope she don't fall. <laughs> Sarah Moe! Make some
I'm running, bitch. I'm running, I'm running. Over here, over here, over here. How you doing? How you doing? Oh, man. Hi, San Antonio. <laughs> bitch, y'all have no idea how excited I've been for this fucking show. <laughs> I get a taste of San Antonio every now and then, but not as much as I need it. And y'all are one of my favorite crowds to perform for. So, make some noise for yourself. Listen, I want you guys to know I'm really going through something hard. I got spray tits today. And I just, it's so hard. I'm kidding, but I'm really not spray tanned though. Bad joke, maybe later. Someone on Twitter said I wanted Farrah to cry, so I was like, what I cry about tonight? Lack de la spring time. <laughs> <See. laughs> oh my god, you guys, I'm so excited to be here. Who's drinking? <laughs> We're always sober, boys and girls. <laughs> Work. <laughs> Work, respect. Um, who's fucking trash? I mean, I mean, who's <laughs> trashed? <laughs> I'm kidding. Aren't we excited that we have a new season of Drag Race to watch this week? I get to be your spoiler queen tonight because I saw the first episode of Eleven. I can't tell you anything. I went to the pit stop, but um, I can't tell you anything but bitch. I wasn't sure about these girls at first. I feel like we all feel that every year, right guys? Where I was like, oh, I don't know what to think about so, so, blah, blah, blah. Bitch, these girls are good TV. And it's not like, it's not like scripted, weird, overproduced good TV. It's like really good personalities that are really having to intermingle with each other. <laughs> and um, that's all I'm gonna say about that. <laughs> Uh, who um, watched All Stars 4? Yeah. I would just like to take this time to congratulate Monet Exchange and Trinity the Tuck. Yeah. I would also like to acknowledge that it took me a very long time to start calling Trinity Trinity the Tuck. Anyone else? Or just yeah. me? Yeah. I just always want to call her Trinity Taylor, and I want to say it with an accent. You know what I mean? Like, I'm from Alabama. Trinity the Tuck Taylor. <laughs> she hates when I do that. <laughs> um, but congratulations to them. They both earned it. I think we all kind of collectively as like an audience watching the show, we're kind of gagged, right? When there was two winners. <laughs> Not boo. <laughs> no, that was me too, but I think that... <laughs> If I worked that hard and I won something, I don't want to share it. But then I learned that's just me being selfish, and it's really awesome that, you know, Drag Race could afford to pay both of them $200,000 each, right? Yeah. It just goes to show that they could afford a bigger prize package for next time. <laughs> Shake Kool-Aid for the $200,000 win. But God damn it, you guys, I'm so excited to be here. I'm going to go, oh, maybe put some clothes on. But I'll see you in a minute. Love you. Y'all, it's just been a long time for a firm. Put your hands together, Pheromone! So that was the first half of Pheromone. I hope y'all enjoyed it. I'm talking solo because that little's already in bed, so. Go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. As usual, check out all my previous content. And see you all in the next video. Bye.